Discord soundboard full guide. So this is a video on how to use Discord soundboard. But before we go to actually show you how to use it, we're going to go through certain things like what is soundboard. So Discord soundboard is a voice channel feature that allows you to play a short audio clip that can be heard by all participants in the same voice channel. So again, you need to be in a Discord call for you to use soundboard. So much like reaction to super reactions, soundboard is a way for you and your friends to express yourself and react to the voice channels, conversations, or live stream. When it comes to soundboard, there are server boosts as well. So server servers have a preloaded sound slots for server members to start using soundboard. So again, this means you have eight free slots to use on Discord soundboard, meaning you can upload eight audio clips, right? Additional slots can be unlocked based on the server's tier level with server boosting. So tier 1, you get 24 slots. Tier 2, you get 35 slots. And tier 3, you get 48 slots. Another thing you need to learn is recently heard. So a recently heard sound is a sound that has been recently been played by someone else through the soundboard. You can access this list by tapping on the soundboard icon while in a voice channel or call and then tapping on the clock icon. Frequently used sounds, on the other hand, is any sound in the soundboard that you have frequently played while in a voice channel or call. The list will get updated as you continue to play more sounds. You can access the list by tapping on the soundboard icon while in a voice channel or call and then tapping on the up arrow icon. Another thing that everybody needs to know are soundboard permissions. Now, what are those? So. It's practically when the server owner or admin gives or removes permissions for uh, server members to use the soundboard option. So how do you do this? Of course, you're going to go to the server and go to the server name over here. Click on this, a drop down will appear. And what you want to do is go click on server settings. So after you click on server settings, you will be brought to this page. Now, look to your left hand side and you, you need to click on roles, which is just below overview. Right? Click on roles. And here, what you want to do is click on default permissions. So default permissions, it's at everybody. What you want to do is scroll down to the near near the very bottom until you see use soundboard. So you can just use soundboard or if you want to remove soundboard permissions for uh, for people, uh, you can just uh, disable it like that. Or if you want to give somebody soundboard permissions, just enable this uh, feature such as like that. All right, so to actually use soundboard, uh, you need to be in a server or in a channel and you need to be in a voice call or a voice channel like this. So I'm going to show you. So let's join this voice call. And as you can see, we are now connected. So for you to use Discord soundboard, all you need to do is look towards your bottom, the very bottom of the screen. You're going to have four options here, right? You're going to have turn on camera, share your screen, start an activity, and the last one is open soundboard shift. So this is pretty much it. So click on this and a pop-up will appear. And as you can see, this is your Discord soundboard. And, you know, I only have one sound right now, which is the like drum meme sound. Uh, so I'm going to play it for you. So I have that. Now, how to add a sound. This is very easy. So all you need to do is click on add sound, right? And then add sound, a pop-up will appear. It says upload a sound. So there are certain things that you need to understand here. File, this is where you browse and choose a file, uh, an audio clip. Sound name, the name you're going to give it. And really emoji, uh, an emoji that you need to choose or would want to choose uh, in regards or in relation to this sound. And then sound volume, very explanatory. Uh, you can just adjust the sound of this emoji, uh, of this clip. Uh, to your heart's content so let's browse and let's say i want this oh no sound so let's play it I, I, by the way you could also play it oh, no. as you can see that's the whole sound right but the oh no is only oh, only here so we can adjust it to be able to So let's adjust it to here. So as you can see, these grayed out areas will not be playable anymore. So let's re replay it again. So let's adjust it one more time on the right hand side like that. And let's play it again. Okay, so now we have that 
the the length of the clip what we want now is to add a name oh no and then click select so what's oh no right uh scared emoji so let's choose maybe this one scream right and then now we need to adjust the volume so let's adjust the volume to 66 for, for example i think that's still very loud let's adjust to 55 still a bit too loud let's go to 50 maybe that's that's going to be sweet spot too loud let's go to 45 there you go i think that's fine and then after that click upload and as you can see here on the soundboard settings we now have two we have the the first one and then we have the oh no click escape now if you want to use a sound uh let's just go to soundboard again and as you can see here uh we have the oh no right we can just click that and everybody will will hear that uh if you want to favorite a sound like this uh the badumps drum meme sound i've favorited so it's it's going to be under favorites now if you want to favorite the oh no just hover your cursor uh on the on the clip on the sound and you're going to see a star on the right side so as you can see favorite oh no click on that it's going to be added to your favorites so that's how you add uh again sound to your favorites and the more you use it the more you know the more the more it's going to be you know in here and as you can see here, there's another uh, pop here, drop into voice channels in style, choose a soundboard sound to automatically play whenever you join a voice only with Nitro. So you could boost this with Nitro as well. Uh, and by the way, you could also use other sounds from other Discord uh, uh, channels if you are you know, capable of doing it. As you can see, we can't because you need to be subscribed. Uh, but again, these are the sounds from your private musings at least for this channel and these are the default uh discord sounds as you can see you have quack you have air horn you have cricket you have bottoms which is pretty much this different tone you have sad horn and you have clap so those are all the things you need for uh to start using discord soundboard again you can boost and have more slots than the eight that you have uh and yeah that's pretty much it that's a video hope you liked it like comment share subscribe bring that bell icon we will see you on the next video Bye bye